I'm back with the, the another episode of the Fortified Game, and uh, I'm playing Mickey Mouse today for, for $200. Gotta watch out for those little bears, of course. Gotta watch out for that, but... Whoa. This is, this is where you go back. Oh, and it repeats itself again. Alright. Yeah, it looks like it loops back to the beginning of this second part. So, here we go. Can we go back there? Nope. That's not the right way. I, 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 I. Can't still. I, I, I'm trying to figure out this way if I can remember. Okay, no, I, I don't know how to figure this thing out. I don't know how to figure this thing out, but let's see if I can decide to pause this game a bit, and uh, we'll see what I find out why if I can do it for you. All right, we're back, and I'm just trying to show you the whole thing and go to the thing and get this thing right off the bat. Yeah, let's shoot this. Okay, let's give you a history lesson here. Um, a lot of these, uh, Mickey Mouse is one of the first of every Mickey game ever produced on the NES, made by Capcom. And this game came out in promotion of the, uh, in honor of Mickey's 60th birthday in 1988. I don't know if I remember back, that was back in the day, I remember. And I always remember, I'm forgetting this one, but... Yep, if you haven't shown you, but this is pretty much fun. There are a lot of good games, that actually, all the Mickey games that came out. The Sega Genesis also has the uh, Castle of Illusion, World of Illusion with Donald Duck in there, and there are a couple of games on the NES that were made by, and of course, long before, he appeared also in Kingdom Hearts game. And this is, this is a pretty fun game to play with. Yeah, and into the garden. Oh. Yeah, it's pretty much like this one, so... Oh, it takes you back to the beginning of the level. Are you crazy? Are you trying to try be crazy here? I'm stupid. It looks like you, 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 you ruined it. I'm, I'm very sorry. I, I, I gotta tell you. I'm, I'm just trying to make to figure out this game. And, you know, I had to get. And then, of course, there are other other great games. I think it was also Disney-based games if you want to. But, if you want to tell you, it's pretty fun. Oh yes, it looks like it goes repeated back to spring. I don't know, I don't know if I had to figure out the spring thing. Okay, let's avoid right over there and see what it is. Where are they? I'm just trying to make sure if there's anything goes in there, I'm not going to go all the way in. And then this is pretty 
much like this one, so... I had to go up there, and there were all the stuff there. After Capcom actually brought out all the Disney games, Disney-based games out there, it was also brought to uh, Disney Interactive, of course, so the game that ever, that ever made this one. Disney Interactive, and I had many other games that just came out. Right. Watch out, a couple of bears that just come in. Yeah, we can get lost in the woods, that's fine with me. But, yeah. And of course, there's winter. Whatever. And you gotta watch out for those here in the woods right now. And yes, you gotta do the same thing as this before. And yes, you can go over there. Oh yes, you can go to start by and shoot this one. See if you go into the garden. Yep, this is the, this is the part where you go to the garden. It kind of reminds me of Alice in Wonderland. If you've watched the film, if you've ever seen the movie Alice in Wonderland, that's right, if you watch, there's the, the flowers. Watch out for those little holes. Yeah, you gotta watch out for those holes. Yeah, you gotta watch out, it looks like an earthquake or something. Well, this is just this is this is just shaping earthquake. And then of course And you can go up there and Alright, just get get on with it and here we go. Stupid snakes. Yeah, this is the quickest boss in this game. Oh yeah. Yep, with those little caterpillar things, like the one you can use in Alice in Wonderland, that's where you defeat this one. Yep, the next one goes to the pirate ship. This is the shortest level of the game. You had to begin with this one. Just take your time. Yep. Yeah, this is this is definitely the shortest level of the game. I don't know if the only time you ever had this level. Yeah. I did tell you. Hey, this is this is too much the shortest level in the game if you ever play with. So, you know, watch out for those little fire things. And the next level, the next boss would be Peg Leg Feet. If you remember them from the cartoon. Well, if you gotta tell you, yeah, shoot this one. There it is. Yep, we just finished the, this is the shortest level of the game. And, the now the last stage of the game is the castle. It's same as the fun house. I gotta tell you, this is pretty fun to play. Okay. What the hell? Yes, this is the, this is the final level of the game. Oh yes, yeah, why? You can shoot those little heart, uh, those little cart things like from Alice in Wonderland characters or something. I don't know if anyone if you were watching Alice in Wonderland. I just tell you. Ah! You saved. Yeah. Looks like you're saving Minnie from the hell. Looks like you kidnapped Minnie from... I hate this. So yeah, looks like you stole Minnie from... Yeah. Yep. And this is where you can save. I'm gonna shoot this. Yeah, you can shoot this enemy right there. There it is. Yeah, there's the, there's the top one. And... I gotta go up there. Uh, oh man. Now, this is, I'm sick and tired of this thing, so. Oh man. Are you, are you stuck? Are you stuck with this thing? Oh no. 
Alright. 